What it do, man? It's your boy Battle Truth coming to you live and direct from the Battle Truth headquarters. Let's get right off into this, man. Bill Cosby was sentenced yesterday to three to ten years in state penitentiary. He was denied bail and took him into custody, man. Sad scene. Sad scene watching that. I don't feel sorry for him. It just looked this sad. I don't feel sorry for him. This brother was found guilty in April of three counts of aggravated indecent assault. Three counts. This brother had like over 30 some women come out saying that this brother drugged and assaulted them. Now, we know sometimes women fabricate. We know sometimes women have been known to lie about these type of situations, but we also know that it's a lot of dudes that be doing that stuff. And anytime you got 30 different women who don't even know each other coming out with these charges against you, saying these things, chances are you might be guilty of one of them. At least. Now, this brother allegedly, not allegedly, because he was found guilty on it, Drugging these women up, mixing drinks and stuff for them, man. These women going to sleep and this brother running right up in them, man. Going up in them, crazy. This brother, like a billionaire. You don't got to do that to nobody. You got all, that just, that's just so selfish. Very evil. Very conniving. Very sinister. That's horrible, fam. All that money, you can have anybody you want who will do it for free. Even bring two, three other girls with them. Give you a good time if that's what you desire and want it. Fine girls that make these girls look like nothing. Wouldn't complain, cry, would kept it a secret and everything. But that's not enough for him. That's too easy. This brother want to create Stephen King series in his house. This brother making Harry Potter magic potions, mixing in these, pe these female drinks, knocking them out, then running up in them. He bogus as hell, man. A straight up creep. A straight up creep. Now, you about to go to jail... <laughs> And be somebody Jello Pudding Pop. <laughs> now you about to go to jail and be somebody Jello Pudding Pop. This brother used to always come out and talk about brothers wearing their jeans sagging, talking about brothers shouldn't say the N word, talking about how brothers should just carry themselves more as gentlemen, talking about how he don't like rap music and all this, putting himself above everybody else. When all along, this brother been knocking women out with drinks since 2003 and four, making magic potion drinks, assaulting women. Three to 10 years, now you're going to prison. Now you're going to prison. A real prison. Don't matter your status. Now you like everybody else. All those brothers you were degrading, talking down against. Now guess what? Now you even lower than a lot of them. Now you finna be right there with them. All the money you got ain't gonna change what you have to live and go through. That's crazy, fam. Doing that stuff like that, brother. I did want to talk about the brothers. They want to go against the brothers. He had all that stuff to say. Feeling himself. Couldn't get enough. Kept it going. Kept it going. Kept him going. This dude was really, really uh, um, a serial Harry Potter potion mixer. A solder. That's crazy, man. That brother got a that brother got a hold to a chemi a chemistry set. Start learning how to make them magic potions and 
charms and things and putting them in these women drinks. This dude even admitted to doing that stuff. That's another thing that got him just convicted. He admitted to doing this stuff. He admitted to actually having the chemicals doing it and actually making them drinks with it. I guess he couldn't live with it no longer. Just wanted his conscience to be clear. Even though this man got a wife. This man got a wife doing all this stuff. Just real selfish, man. Got a history, man, of making all these strong, super black movies. Fat Alberts, Brothers in the Ghetto, trying to uh, do things positive and be honest. The Huckables showing a black family living who actually got wealth and not living in poverty. A different world showing brothers how uh, you can achieve your goals and go to college and things like that. She's doing a lot of positive things, but behind closed doors. This dude was just a sinister potion maker, pervert, a real live creep. Now you got bought to justice. Now you actually got brothers saying, oh, Hollywood set them up. See how Hollywood and them do them brothers? We not finna blame Hollywood. We not finna blame no white man. Man, that brother is just a creep. A straight up freak and a creep. Have nothing to do with, oh, they set him up. They set him up. Right. Sent 30 women at him. Let's see if he can't resent himself. That's a creep. Something wrong with that dude. Nobody set him up. Well, I just hope they don't set him up in jail. Because he got to come up out of them $1,000 suits and put on that cheap $3 county suit. He found guilty. He got to go to prison. Now he's just like everybody else. Don't feel sorry for him, y'all. Don't feel sorry for him. That's real talk. It's your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment that's a question. It's yours. Bill Coffey sentenced three to ten years in prison, man, for uh, being found guilty of three counts of aggravated and decent assault. So I don't feel bad for him. That's what he get.